All right, everyone, I have a Switch Pro rumor for you and more. Uh, this is this is interesting. This is very, very interesting. Um, I was turned on to this new person on Twitter that I don't even know. I, I don't even I'm not even really sure how to describe this person. Uh, it is a collection of people. They claim to be uh, game developers, journalists, also, some people that work at adult stores, so places where you would get after-night activities for those 18 and older. Um, it, it, yeah, it's weird. But I went through their history, uh, and it turns out they've actually been pretty accurate on a lot of their leaks, but they've mostly flown under the radar. Now, they talk mostly about Nintendo stuff, and they claim that they're actually talking to people that potentially work um, at Nintendo of Japan and also like Redmond. So, you know, you guys can extrapolate from there, uh, who they might be talking to. Uh, let's just get into the switch pro stuff because I, this is like some interesting stuff that sounds very Nintendo. So the Twitter account is called at hot girl videos 69. I told you guys, this is one of the weirdest things I've ever seen. Um, Tiffany Treadmore incorporated i don't even know if that's a real business i'm probably trolling anyways tomorrow we are meeting with four internal nintendo cucks i mean I, i'm telling it's the strangest thing we've ever talked about on this channel for a leak this is significant news brewing there will be leaks after the new year regarding the new switch model so the switch pro once holiday season is over it will likely start trickling in there won't be vr so no vr uh, they go on to say, current biggest rumor and leaks are related to AR functions for new Joy-Con accessories. Additionally, regarding new hardware made for budget gamers. A lot about controls right now. So they're hearing a lot about like different controllers or controller accessories. Really weird. Not, so, not, not exactly what we thought we could hear about in the new year. Um, then it says, you know, do you meet with all of them at once or one at a time? Uh, they said, this is a good question. Two... We will frequently meet together. The others are separate. Two work in a place called Redmond, Washington, uh, and they are working from home currently. One is in New York City. The other is in Kyoto, Japan, which is where Nintendo's Japanese headquarters are located. So, yeah, what the hell are we talking about? Like, what, who even is this person? And what the hell are these rumors? AR? Now, Nintendo has done AR. They've been at the, almost the forefront of AR. Uh, the 3DS was a massive AR machine. It came with included AR cards, for crying out loud, and AR games. And, like, AR is something Nintendo has dabbled in, but the Switch hasn't really dabbled in. You could you could say that there's been a little bit of augmented reality if you want to count the uh, little IR camera that they've used in 1-2 Switch and pretty much absolutely nothing else. But we haven't really seen AR happen until, of course, don't forget, Mario Kart Live. Now, Mario Kart Live is an AR game. Let's not kid ourselves. That's exactly what it is. You have a physical item that you interact with, uh, with virtual stuff on a screen. Uh, yeah, that's that's AR. It's AR. Like, Nintendo is really pushing AR with Mario Kart Live. So, it's possible there's more Mario Kart Live-like things happening in 2021. Not quite as crazy as it might have initially sounded like, but yeah. Um, they said there's going to be a new Switch model, like, once holiday season's over, get to January. That's why we're not hearing a lot of leaks or rumors or anything right now. Everyone's just kind of holding in until holidays are over, uh, maybe at the request of their leakers, uh, of the sources. I have no idea because we don't want to affect Nintendo Switch holiday sales. This was always a prevailing theory that the reason the Nintendo Switch Pro rumors started dying down about two months ago is because, hey, we're entering the holidays Everyone's going to be respectful of Nintendo. Let them sell their systems. We'll get back at this at the new year. But they had other things they put out there. So this isn't it. Um, here's a rumor. NES Remix. You guys remember NES Remix? It will be revamped and re-released for Nintendo Switch in late summer of 2021. and will include additional console material. What? With the NES Classic and the NES Online on the online service? What? What? <laughs> 
<laughs> but but this is like a very Nintendo thing. Like Nintendo would be the one to repackage NES games to you for the third time in four years and just sell them to you again. It would totally be a Nintendo move to be like, oh, we hear you. You want you want N64. You want this. You want that. You know what? We're gonna give you the NES Remax again. <laughs> Like, the thing is, this is very plausible that Nintendo would do this. So those are kind of the big, the two big rumors floating out there right now. Um, they've done talks in the past on the Switch Pro. Uh, this Twitter account has mostly just saying it's happening. Uh, you know, there'll be some screen stuff and other things like that. Nothing, nothing huge. Uh, there's been a couple of people that try to. Uh, discredit these people by crediting rumors to them that if you look publicly they never stated so you know I, I think there's some people that are uncomfortable with this twitter account i can't blame them i'm going to be very careful when i show you uh certain things from this twitter account uh but you know they say nintendo and hot video game leaks from a mysterious group of strangers the, uh, season one that supposedly ends so season two begins when i have no idea um but like You'll, you'll see, you know, stuff like this on their account. Uh, they retweeted some cyberpunk stuff. You'll see advertisements for an adult store. Like here, thanks for following me for Nintendo News and Leaks, but I need your help to keep growing. To help support, please shop at the Adult Novelty Store. And it is an Adult Novelty Store. I think it's in Texas. I was checking it out just to make sure that, you know, they weren't just giving people um, viruses and stuff because, uh, you know, it could be a troll account. But they have quite a few followers, 5,757. Um, I, I, I don't really know. Uh, the, 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 this, this account is like, I'm not crazy here. This account is followed by stealth and Greg Miller. Like, like stealth, this guy, he's legit, legit industry insider is following this person. Greg Miller, Tim Gettys, Chris Kohler. These are people that matter in the world of video game journalism. These people are following like this. I don't know what the hell is up with this really weird account. You know, this hot girls, 69, hot girl videos, 69. I don't know. I, I don't know. This is one of the craziest things. And for this to be like a such not Nintendo friendly kind of person advertising adult toys, being a source for Nintendo rumors. You know what? Why not? It is 2020. Crazier things have happened. Uh, Nintendo had someone working for them that was doing extracurricular activities at night. I don't really care that they were doing those activities. Nintendo did, of course. Uh, but, like, seriously, I don't understand, uh, what is going, like, like, what's this website? Do I dare click? Do I, do I dare click on Tiffany? Dr I might regret this. This might get cut out. What is this? Am I clicking away? Hi, I'm Tiffany Treadmore, a.k.a. Hot Girl Video 69 on Twitter. I am a cam girl. And a Pornhub producer who leaks info about video. Here we go. Now we're getting juicy. <laughs> also, I write stories and make things. This is my website. You can read my short little interactive poem about my feelings during the coronavirus pandemic. Here. Uh, where does that link? Um, to schoolgirlgames.com. Yeah, we're going to... We're going to stay away from that one. You can play a pseudo-biographical game about my experience as a little girl below. A Haywood Wanderer, a piece of interactive fiction by Tiffany Treadmore. Um, again, that's schoolgirlgame.com. We're going to not go deeper than this on an admitted cam girl and Pornhub producer. I, I don't know what's happening. And I'm not going to bother to Google Tiffany Treadmore to find out if that's like a porn star name because it very well might be. All I know is... There's legit people in the industry following this person, and they're putting out rumors, and have gotten a whole bunch of crap correct. I'm gonna stop scrolling down. It gets, it, it gets, yeah. We're just gonna stick with. Here's the Switch Pro rumors. It's cool. Also, NES remix. Apparently, you guys, let me know what you think about this down in the comments below. What, what's even happening? All right, folks. I'll catch you in the next video.